in the past when you are using DMP3 or polling architectures you have to have a very profound knowledge in terms of how this protocol actually works you have to use an Excel spreadsheet to create a tag one by one you have to go through a very lumbersome configuration you know on the OPE server but right now our solution have a patented technology called active auto, -gener auto tag generation technology which means when I press the create tag all the IO tag will be wrapped up and then sent back through Theodore to the OB server and generate all the tags uh, you know in a few seconds uh, this is the IO logic W5340 is a remote terminal unit it's got a GPRS embedded with four analog inputs and 12 digital input and output and two relays it is designed for you to uh, do remote data acquisition and control uh, today we are going to show you just how to bring all those I.O. signal back to the central side through the cellular communication and how easy that is. This demo box is being hardwired th to those sensors right here. It's got analog readings and digital input and outputs right here. This is the uh, active OPU server that is sitting on top of a public fixed IP. In real in your real applications this OP server is going to integrate with your SCADA systems this is the uh, configuration workstation being hardwired to your demo box through the Ethernet cable uh, to do the configuration is actually very simple the first thing is just typing the IP address of the active OP server uh, the active OB server IP address have already been typed in after you typed in you have to press the update and this de device will start automatically the second step that you have to do is you just select the IO channel and then press create tag and then yes Now all the IO tag is being generated to the OPE server. As you can see, there are a lot of IO tags is being created back to the OPE server. All right, let's go back to the demo box. Now I'm going to remove the uh, Ethernet just to show you. you know, there's no hot wire, you know, connected to uh, to the uh, active OPE server except for just one you know invisible GPRS communication alright now I'm going to turn this dial a little bit this is the, the analog readings that feed directly into the IO logic and then send through the cellular as you can see as I turn the dial you can see the number is fluctuating almost simultaneously uh, this is just a very simple demo uh, if you are interested in more uh, te technical backgrounds or product introductions, you can go to our website. Uh, there are a lot of information out there for you to browse.